back-to-back -back nights. It was a cold October night, and I was sitting in my bedroom, looking out the window, watching the leaves blow across the driveway. It's at that moment I realized we should make a new spoof. So I took out my phone, this one right here, and I called my best friend Alan. I was sitting in my basement playing with Legos when I got Craig's phone call. My phone rang. What's up, dude? How's it going? Oh, Look, good. I'm just playing with you. I got Legos. an awesome idea. What's your idea? All right. I think we need to make a new spoof. What? That is the stupidest idea I've ever heard in my entire life. Why would you want to be making a new spoof, Craig? Because it's fun? All right, cool. Let's do it. All right. So I have a few ideas, and I want to run them past you, see what you think. Craig, I will always listen to your ideas. Go ahead, what are they? Hannah Montana. No, I am not doing Hannah Montana. You know that people with split personalities freak me out, and that girl plays two parts. I am not going to do Hannah Montana. Okay, okay. What's your other idea? Madagascar 2. Which one is that again? That's the one with the zebras and the lions and the penguins. That's animated, isn't it? Yeah. That's a stupid idea. How are we going to do an animated spoof, Craig? We don't even have the, the computer technology to do that. Well, I was, you know, we could do face paint and like, <laughs> get action figures and do some stop motion. It'd be really fun. Yeah, that could work. Yeah. yeah wh what other ideas do you have? That's in the maybe box. Uh, Twilight? <laughs> Twilight? Yeah, Twilight. You want to do? We already did a Twilight spoof. Why would you want to do another spoof, Craig? What, what possible reasons could you have going through your mind that would say, "Hey, let's make another Twilight spoof"? <laughs> do you know how many girls love Twilight? <laughs> that is a genius idea. I know, right? I am, I am so. Let's do a spoof. Let's film it right now. It was at that moment, me and Alan got all our camera equipment, went out and filmed a new Twilight spoof, playing every character ourselves. I went to the local zoo to pick up some chimpanzees, because who doesn't want that in the spoof? <laughs> then I told Alan there are no chimpanzees in Twilight, and I had my grandma bake cookies so he wouldn't be hungry on set. I ate all of those before Craig even saw them. And then I went to the gas station to get 11,000 gallons of gasoline and one match, because we were going to have some pyrotechnics. Then I collected as many lightsabers and bottles of blood as I could to make the most ultimate vampire movie of all time. And then we started filming. One hour and 15 minutes later, we finished. I brought the footage home and began to edit. Done. I then took out my phone, this one right here, and I called my best friend, Alan. Hey, what's up, Craig? Dude, I finished editing. Awesome, I'll be at your house in one second. All right. Hey, what's up? How's it going? Good. All right, let's watch this movie. And play. to regret the decisions that brought me face to face with death. They also brought me to Edward. <laughs> Mom! Did you like it? Awesome. We didn't really have much planned. Um, yeah, we were, we, uh, hmm. 